think everyone thought it was a joke at first that she was going to pay us to not look at our phones, that she cares so much about mindfulness and being aware of how often you're on screens. So I think that's really cool, but also no one really knew if she was serious or not. So She said she was going to give $100, and of course everyone was like really, really <laughs> excited about that. My principal said she was going to give us $100 hundred dollars from her own pocket money. If you could go uh, all 11 Tuesdays of the summer without any tech. Many are grown from the students and I heard many cheer from the parents. I was saving up for a bunny and um, I needed a hundred dollars to get that bunny. I needed the hundred dollars because I really want to get this new video game. No TV, no phones, devices or computers, laptops. You couldn't, you know, text your friends or do FaceTime or watch Netflix or go see a movie. Or... Everything except for like cars and microwaves and fridges and all those like things you can't play on. It was hard when you had friends over and you were extremely bored and you're like, oh geez, what am I going to do now? I did not want to be in the house on a techless Tuesday. I just want to be away from my house. My parents would be like, ha ha, this reminds me of when I was a kid and we had to make plans the old fashioned way. Everybody was on their phone because apparently there was this new like video that was out and people were watching it. It was really funny. I just wasn't able to look at it. It was so devastating. <laughs> A few of my friends and I exchanged home phone numbers and we would call each other on the home phone. So it was definitely, felt like we were throwing it back a few decades. I went to the pool, I read books, played board games, went to a cave. And I talked with my parents for like four hours. I went for a walk, or I swam, or I kayaked. I think I played golf one time. It's actually pretty, it's really fun. Hang out with my family, my sisters would play games for the first time in like eight years because they were bored and then I would just go to bed early. <laughs> yes, I think I slept a lot more Tuesdays. I got, got back on beauty rest those Tuesdays. It was the final Tuesday before we went back to school. I was like, I want to give up. I don't want to do this anymore because it was, it was the last day. I'm honestly surprised that 36 people completed it and that 70 even tried to begin with just based on the reaction of everyone in the room when Miss Smith first said it. No Tech Tuesday has like affected me in a way that like my brain doesn't automatically think I'm bored. Oh, I'll just play Xbox or I'll get on my phone. I just wanted hundred dollars. I didn't make it. <laughs> It's like, yes, I finished it, and I am done with it. 